The Bahamas Technical and Vocational Institute taking a new approach to engaging students as efforts continue to improve the quality of courses offered at that career training institute. Fern Carey tells us that the move is expected to help fill the skills gap in this country. With many local companies expressing concern about the increasing skills gap in the country, President of the Bahamas Technical and Vocational Institute, Dr. Robert Robertson, says efforts are underway to address it. He said that BTVI has adopted a new approach in its offerings, which is proving successful. However, the BTVI president noted that the skills gap is an issue that is impacting countries globally. Skills like communication, working in teams, working with other people, um, basic math skills, basic literacy, reading skills, those are critically important. And guess what? Those skills are critically boring <laughs> to a student. And so we have to try to challenge students and, and build math skills, for example. If a person comes to BTVI and does not like math, and that happens a lot, it happens at other schools as well, um, what we try to get the instructors to do is contextualize the academics, the theory, to practice. Um, make make examples uh, for them of, of things they, they can see and then pull that back to mathematics. And to ensure that BTVI is in line with global trends, Dr. Robertson indicated that the Institute also uses technology to match student skills. There's a system called Alex, which is a, a computer system. So you can take in the lecture at the class, but you would also go home and go online and fool around with this Alex thing and it'll 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 probe your skill level and help you to advance um, using technology. So it's really helpful. And if you're the kind of person who has a math phobia, you're not going to stand up in class if someone asks you an answer and give a wrong answer. It's embarrassing to everyone. You wouldn't do it. But if you're at home alone on the computer, you can take that risk and chance and you can actually learn. And that's, that's what that Alex system does. Dr. Robertson said BTVI is also partnering with planning advisory groups in order to get feedback to guide the programs that develop workforce skills. We were just talking about a, a few companies on the way here today who um, take um, BTVI students initially as interns and then possibly convert them to full-time employees. And basically we get the feedback from them, those companies, about what it is that they value in those students, those interns, what it is they see we can improve on, and oftentimes they help us to make those improvements. And by helping us, I mean they provide us perhaps with scholarships, they provide us with um, maybe some new computers or new equipment. We've recently had a company uh, give us some solar panels. Frank Geary, Zeta Network News.